Hey everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you how to change your barometric pressure units on your Casio Protrek PRG 600 watch. This is module 5497 from Casio. So what are we talking about? This watch has a built-in barometer on it and you have two different options in terms of showing your uh, barometric pressure. You can either show it in hectopascals or inches of mercury. I'm going to go ahead and press the mode button. It's the bottom left button. When we press it, it will take us into our barometer and you can see that my barometer is showing 30.10 inches of mercury. I know it's probably hard to see, but at the top of the digital display, it will tell you, it will give you the abbreviation for whether or not you're looking at it in inches of mercury or hectopascals. It's kind of like a temperature sensor. Usually you have one or the other that you're kind of used to looking at. Well, mine's in inches of mercury. What if we want to switch that to hectopascals? How would we do it? The key is, is we have to be in the barometer mode, which I am currently in. When we are in the barometer mode, we are going to start by unscrewing the crown on the right hand side. Once the crown has been unscrewed you'll kind of feel it pop out a little bit. Now we're going to simply pull out the crown and we will see our barometric pressure start blinking. Now at this point we're going to press the bottom left button and it will go to unit. Now this is the tricky part because it's kind of hard to see but you will see in my case it says inches of mercury. If I turn it it will switch it to hectopascals. Not sure if there's a better way I can show you that, but that value is blinking up top there. Set it to whatever unit you need to. I'm going to simply, in my case, I switched it to hectopascals. I'm going to press the crown back in, and we can see now it's gone back to our barometer mode. We are out of the barometric pressure settings, and we can see that our barometer is showing. 1020 hectopascals instead of inches of mercury. Those are the only two options you have on this watch. There's other watches on the market like Garmin that give you, you know, millimeters of mercury and some other values. On this watch, you've just got hectopascals or inches of mercury. Once we are done, the last thing we need to do is we need to screw the crown back in. And we've successfully adjusted our units. We can stay in the barometer mode, or we can always press the mode button to go back to our main watch face, or we can press and hold the mode button, and it will take us out of the barometer, take us back to our main watch face. That's how you change your barometer units on your Protrek PRG 600 watch. As always, I hope the video helps.